Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Now in this video, we're going to be making an intro on Scratch. So here's a quick example. So that's short and sweet, so let's get started immediately. Right, so first we need two different sprites. We need one called Swipe, which is just it just has a random color. I chose blue and one sprite, which, call, which is called logo with just your logo. For example, mine is eight. Now let's get coding. One click show, and you're gonna go to a certain position. And this position is gonna be um, 544, 79. Right, after that, we're gonna repeat 30 times. And we're going to move to the left. So we're going to move uh, 30 times, negative 25 times. It's going to move to the left as you can see. Right, so then after that, we're going to split it in half. So in order to do that, we need to create our clone. So I'm going to do repeat one, create clone of myself. In order to track our clones, I created a variable called clone ID. So I am going to change the clone ID one. And one ID start as a clone, set clone ID to one. Then I'll go to a certain position, negative 206, negative 273, and then it's going to move down. This clone is going to move down. So we're going to do repeat 20 times. Change Y by negative 30, and then it's going to hide. It's the same thing, except um, we're going to make it 30 for the second clone, or second. Okay, I think we should add a quick delay, so it actually waits for a while. So make it around 0.5 seconds right there. Yeah, pretty good, right? And after that, we're going to broadcast the logo. So the logo does its work. So before we get started on this sprite, make sure you have four sprites. Second sprite say games in whatever font, then games animations, games animation more. Right, so now I'm gonna do one click. It's gonna hide and when I receive the message, it's gonna show. When I receive logo, it shows and it goes to it goes around um, negative. Yeah, so it's gonna go to negative seven, negative two, and then it's gonna repeat 10 times. And make sure it points in direction 90 over here, and then it points in direction 90 here, and points in direction 90 here. And it's gonna turn 18 degrees, and it's gonna turn counterclockwise 18 degrees. So we're making it 18 degrees because um, it turns 180 degrees and then 180 degrees again. And make sure you switch costume to the first one, obviously. Then we're going to do the small little shakes. So we're going to do it 10 times, pick random, pick random. So go to pick random 1 to 10, pick random 1 to 10, 10 times. So yeah, pretty good, right? And then after that, three times, it's going to switch to the next costume. So it's going to wait about 0.2 seconds. 0.2 seconds and to the next costume. Right, I'm just going to add a quick effect. Right, so I just did a fade in and fade out. So let's test this out. So now that's done, we want this to hide. We're wait about one second and then hide. So wait one little second. And then after we're gonna do one final sweep up to down, I mean down to up. <laughs> so we're gonna broadcast final sweep, final swipe, final swipe. And when I do receive the swipe, I will be going to, um, I'll show first of all, 
and I'll go to the position negative 143 then it's gonna move 15 times it's gonna move up 15 times by 30 so we're gonna change y by 30 and it's gonna wait one about one second so the user can see what's going on and then we're gonna hide it and if you have all if you have any sounds you can just clear out sound effects and you can just stop all sounds let's check it out Wow, this is quite neat. If you liked this video, please do like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys later.